That fog just makes it look eerie and really funny. <laughs> Sunday said, wait, cool. Wish we were with you, guide. Happy Independent Night. Thank you. Francisco Bay formed a 50 mile long barrier to highway traffic in the San Francisco area. And the entrance from the sea, known as the Golden Gate, separated the growing city on the south from the lightly populated and excellent recreation areas of Marin County. While a bridge was an obvious need, it was not an obvious possibility. The challenge was not to bridge a river or a valley, but an arm of the ocean. The proposed bridge was this one, impressive in its simplicity, modern in its concept. The center span from tower to tower would be 4,200 feet long, the longest ever attempted in that time. The side spans would each be 1,125 feet long. The roadway would be some 250 feet above the choppy waters of the bay. The towers, which will be erected on each pier, are identical. 
702 feet of steel rising to an elevation of 746 feet above sea level. Two legs joined together by six cross braces. The legs are 90 feet apart on centers. Clearance between the legs at deck level is 60 feet, the width of the six-lane roadway. When the bridge is completed, there will be no other structure this tall between San Francisco and New York City. On November 11th, 1935, the task of spinning the two great cables is begun. From then on, the Golden Gate is steadily bridged wire by wire. The workmen of the cable contractor stitch the north and south shores together with 80,000 miles of wire. Each wire measures just under one-fifth of an inch in diameter, slightly smaller than a lead pencil. Spinning carriages shuttle from anchorage to mid-span, playing out as many as six wires on each trip. The cables, when completed, will weigh 22,000 tons apiece. It's interesting to note that each cable weighs approximately as much as each tower. The wires, 27,572 of them per cable, build up to a compacted cable slightly over three feet in diameter. Later, as the roadway takes shape, the cables will be wrapped with galvanized wire and painted to protect them against the elements. The spinning of the cables is completed in May of 1936. Bethlehem, builder of the towers, begins erecting the suspended span on June 18th. The engineering problems in erecting the roadway were challenging. The main span was the longest ever attempted, 4,200 feet from tower to tower, with side spans of 1,125 feet. As every engineer knows, there was the delicate problem of making sure that the two sections of roadway moving out from each tower would meet at the center within exacting tolerances. The entire span would be constructed from elementary structural forms. The stiffening truss panels would consist of top and bottom cords, diagonals, and verticals. The verticals are spaced at 25-foot intervals. Suspender strands occur at every other vertical. The truss measures 28 feet deep. The roadway floor beams are eight and a half feet deep, 87 feet long, and weigh, on the average, 23 tons each. And so the span progresses, moving out truss by truss in four directions to maintain equal loading on the cables and towers. By fall of 1936, residents of San Francisco are treated to the sight of a span which moves steadily closer to the day when the two halves will meet. Finally, on November 18, 1936, the closing members are lowered into place. The Golden Gate is bridged. For Chief Engineer Joseph Strauss, and for every engineer who has contributed to the work, this is a day of realization, the type of day which fulfills the life of an engineer, first as a dream, then as a magnificent accomplishment. Fog makes one of its regular visits as the finishing touches are added to the bridge, creating a strange kind of beauty. And so, the work is completed. The bridge that pessimists said could not be built, has been built. May 28th, 1937, opening day.
labor accounts vary on the amount of celebrating done by San Francisco. Some say four days, some say a week. It was a celebration worthy of the bridge. It was such men who designed and built the Golden Gate Bridge. Bridge with us today yeah. and Bay Bridge and all that. So yeah, yeah we had a really good day with her today. So thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs>